Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another tutorial. Today we're going to be building the Ohio class submarine. So before I get into this, I just do want to uh, say that the propeller design on the back is not my design. That was designed by someone else on the server I build on. I don't know who it is. I asked, but uh, didn't get uh, any helpful answers that could say who it was. In, and I'm um, currently recording this in 1.12.2. So that's why there's bubbles around it. 1.3, got that problem solved, but I haven't moved all this stuff over yet. But um, this is what we will be building. Uh, I will show you what it is like underwater, uh, out of water I meant, so in the, when I start the tutorial. But yeah, that pretty much covers this. Let's get into it. Okay, so this is what the, uh, this is what the sub looks like out of the water. Um, it currently goes in depth about 10 blocks deep, but if you want to go any deeper, you can. Just don't uh, bring it any shallow, otherwise it'll probably look a bit bit weird if you got it uh, too far out of water, unless it's in like a dry dock or something like that. But you can do what you want, it's up to you. But I would recommend 10 blocks. So to start this off, I'm just going to quickly change the weather, because uh, it makes it a bit hard to see what I'm doing. Alright, so to start this off, you want to build a line of 24. So you're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Then you're going to go 23. And then a 22 to start this off. Now I'll cop copy this uh, to the other side, so it should I can get things to work should be the 23 and then the 22 it should be five wide in total and you just drag that to the other side like so so actually I'll just quickly do it the first layer because it's fairly simple and it doesn't add any unnecessary time so that's what you should have and we'll get on to the next layer okay so to start off this second layer what we want to do is we want to build four from the center point forward so we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, like that. That was some really bad counting. And then we're going to count back another 4. Then we're going to go, we're going to skip 2. And on the second, we're going to go 1, 2, 3. And then we're going to go 1. And then we're going to go 1, 2. And we're just going to pretty much drag that back. So I can grab that. Just drag this all the way to the back. Like so and copy that to the other side and we'll get on to the next layer okay so let's get on with the next layer which should be layer three if i'm counting correct yes i am all right so it starts off you want to put down a row of three down the middle and then you're going to go another three you're going to come back and then one and then go three and then you're going to come back one again you're going to go seven so two four six seven come back to here come uh, on this one, you're going to come back one, you're going to go two, four, and then five. Come back to the front, skip two, go two, four, and then you're going to come here, you're going to come out, you're going to skip that four, and on the next line, you're just going to go straight to the back. Like that, copy that to the other side, and then that's what you should have. Alright, let's get on to the next layer. Okay, so let's continue on with this. Um, so you're going to come to the middle, and then you're going to put in another three. Was that last one three? Yeah, well, like that, that makes sense. Right, so put in another three, and then you're going to skip one. You're going to go two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Then you're going to skip this next line, and then you're just going to come to where this hole is. You're going to go two, four, six, eight. So it would be eight. Then you're going to grab a black block. You're just going to put that behind, uh, behind there. Do that on the other side as well. So it should have this little line down the middle. And then you're going to come on top of this one. You're going to go two, and then put one there. And you're just going to drag that all the way to the back. And that finishes off this layer so what these lines are these are the tr torpedo tubes that are on the front 
So I'll show you we're about there. One's there and the other one's there. So copy that to the other side and then we'll get onto the next layer. Okay, so let's continue this off. So what you want to do is you want to come to where this little one is sticking out. You're going to put a two on top of that and then you're going to put another two and then you're going to come to this back one here. So it should be a three by two in the center. Then you're going to put a one there. You're going to go two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Then you're going to come back here. You're going to put, you're going to skip two and you're going to put three. You're going to come to where this gap is here. You're going to just bring that out or you can fill it in and you're just going to drag this all the way back to on top of that little, to where that black block is. And then you're going to come in four. So it'd be two, four, and then on the fifth, you're going to go one, two, three, and then you're going to come back to here. You're going to bring this out and then you're just going to drag this all the way to the back. So you should have this. All right, but copy that to the other side and get on to the next layer. Okay, so let's get on to the next layer. So what you want to do is you want to come to the middle and you're just going to bring this out by two blocks. Well, you're going to bring it out a block, but have a block behind it. And then beside it, you're going to bring it out by two. And then you're going to put one behind that, like that. So it should be two, then two going sideways, and then one behind it. Then you're going to go three. So one, two, three. Three again. And then a four, two, four. Like so. So it should be three, three, four. And then pretty much the re next layer just drags back. Like so. All right. That finishes that. This is what it should look like from above. And we'll get on to the next layer. Oh, make sure you copy that to the other side. I forgot to say that. And we're gonna let's get on to the next layer. Okay, so for the black layer, we're gonna build. I'm gonna build it out of white. You just find a black block that you choose to use, and pretty much follow along. I'll build it out of white because black is easier to show when you like in tutorials when you're doing it in white rather than black. So what you want to do is you're just gonna build a three across the front. So it should be like that. Then you're going to put a 1 behind it, and then you put a 3 behind it, another 3, and then a 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. And then the next layer just drags all the way to the back. And fill in the gaps. Copy that to the other side, and that's what you should have. Alright, let's get on to the next layer. Okay, so let's continue on with the next layer. So what you want to do is you want to place one in the middle and then come to where this one block is. You're going to put two, two going towards the front and then one behind it. Then you're going to go a three, a three, and then a four, and then drag to the back. So pretty much the last layer, but a block back. Uh, copy that to the other side. I tried to say end just then, but I just said eh. Uh, copy that to the other side, and we'll get on to the next layer. That's the above look. Remember, it's uh, one, two, one, three, three, four, and then the long run. All right, so let's get on to the next layer. Okay, so for the next layer, what you want to do is uh, you want to bring it in a block, and then you're just going to put uh, one in the middle, one on the side. And then you're going to go behind that, you're going to place a block. And then next to that block, you're going to place two blocks. Then you're going to put a three, and then a four, and then another three. And then you're just going to drag that line to the back. Like so. Okay, copy that to the other side. Remember, it's one, two, two, three, four, three. And then your line to the what's the back of that. Uh, copy that to the other side, and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, let's get on to the next layer. So to start us off, we're going to do a three down the middle again, from where that gap is. Then we're going to go another three. Uh, then we're going to go a four, two, four. Then we're going to go another 
we're going to go five, two, four, five. And then we're going to, so it should be like three, then back a block, three, black block, three, uh, four, back a block, five. And then you're going to come in two blocks and we're going to go one, two, three, four. Then we're going to come on along, along this block here where you should just skip a block on this line here and just fill in on it above it pretty much. Like so. So remember it should be three, three, four, five, and then a four, and then your line. Copy that to the other side, and we're going to the next layer. Okay, so for the next layer, we're getting close to finishing the front section. So what you want to do is you want to come where this gap is, you're going to build this up, and then you're just going to go three, and then another three, another three, then you're going to skip two blocks and then put a two. Then you're going to go two, four, five. And then you're going to go uh, in a block, out of blockament. And then you just got to drag that to the back. Like so. So it's three, 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 two, and then five, and then your long run. And that's how it connects in, like that. Or probably show it like that, it's easier to show, easier to see what's like that. Alright, so copy that to the other side, and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so for the next layer, we're going to start off by building a 4 on top of that gap, and then we're going to build another 4 along the side of it, so we're going to come back 1, then build another 4, come skip 2, then build a 3, and then we're just going to put a 1 in that corner piece there, so it should be uh, 4, four, three, one, with a gap of one, two, two, then one. Okay, next we're just gonna pretty much uh, drag two there, put two there. And we're just gonna pretty much build that back towards the back. Like so. And then on the end, we're gonna cut out 10. So it'll be two, four, six, eight, 10. Like that, copy that to the other side. Uh, this is what it should look like on this layer once you've finished it and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so to start this off, um, what you want to do is you just want to pretty much build a line straight down the middle. So it should go straight to the end and pretty much that's what you're going to do with this next layer. You're just going to pretty much just fill in a line going all the way down to the bottom of the back. Uh, fill in uh, the two lines there, I meant. So pretty much just fill all this in on top. So it should be a one, a one, and then what, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. And then you got your ten. You got your ten going in, and then you're gonna put a two in on the end. Now for these uh, slabs on top, you just wanna pretty much come back in six, and then you're gonna place two. So you'll go two, four, six, one, two on the seventh and eighth. Come to the back, you're just gonna pretty much skip two on the in and then place one. Skip three, place another one on the other side. And then you're gonna go two, four, six, eight, and it'll be on the eighth. And I don't know what that glitch is there. So pretty much what you <laughs> what you should have when you're finished is it should look like that on top. That was probably the worst explaining I've ever done on this, on a tutorial, just filling in that. But it's pretty straightforward. It's 1, 1, it's 12, then t uh, 8, and then a 2 on the end. It should be like that. So copy that to the other side. There's a view from above. Like that. And that finishes off this front section. So that finishes off section one. Let's get on to section two. Section sh two should be pretty straightforward, but we'll get on to that now. Okay, so this middle section, section two, should be pretty straightforward. So where we have this uh, last slab, pretty much this whole round bit here, you wanna drag this all the way uh, about 88, well not about, it's exactly 88 extra um, blocks long. So pretty much from here 
to all the way back here will be 88 blocks. So pretty much that last layer, which is a um, which is the two, uh, two, 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 three, two, then two, and then it drags across the top like that. So as I just filled in there, you want to pretty much drag that 80, uh, 88 blocks to the back, to the back of the sub. All right, so what we're going to do next is we're just going to do the markings on top. So pretty much uh, behind this, you're going to skip two, and then you're going to cut out a plus symbol, and then put a, it'll be a three with a one on the on towards the side, and then a button in the middle. You're going to skip another three. You're going to place one. Uh, I'm going to actually have to have a quick look here. All right. So what we're going to put next, we're going to put a two and then a nine. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Then we're going to put another two and then a one. I'm going to quickly grab everything I need now. So what we're going to do next is we're going to skip a block. We're going to cut out another three for another plus symbol. And then we're going to put a white block in there. And then we're going to put a button on top. We're going to skip a block. We're going to cut out a three by three here. And then you're going to do that another 11 times. So there should be 12 cutout points all up. Like so. So that'd be three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're just going to fill them in with a lighter shade of black. So as you can see over here, I've got uh, concrete as my primary and then black wool as my secondary black. It's up to you to pick the ch color choice that you use. That's what I use. You just got to pretty much fill each of those holes in. Like so. And just pretty much fill that all the way to the front. Uh, up to the front. Just keep filling in all these holes. It, if you want to have the doors open, I'll show you how to do that one in a second. Actually, I'll, uh, I'll just fill in these two and then I'll show you on this front one. So, yeah, if you, if you have it closed, you're just going to put three buttons like that. Put one going in and then two on the outside. If you have it open, pretty much just build the three by three like that. Likewise with the buttons, put three on the bottom, one on the top. Then on the inside, uh, how I've got mine is I pretty much, uh, I'll just use the white for this, I've pretty much just done a three going down. All the way to the bottom. Then a three there, a three there, a three there, like that. So it leaves a three by three gap in the middle. And just pretty much build that up. like so do it on these sides here now the only downside about these being so big is um, it doesn't re really leave you any room for the interior so this is the center line here so it blocks that off so you have to if you want to put in like a walkway it's going to have to go down the side here and then it should we will just quickly build this side up here. Now what I put in down the bottom of the tube is I put stone. Like that. And then I grabbed cobblestone wall. And I pretty much just build that up. So leave it a block short just for the um, 
top of the um, the door so that it closes down like that and then at the bottom because if you have it if you have it empty grab a uh, trap door an iron trap door and just pretty much fill that in down the bottom like that if you have it full we'll put you'll put in the ballistic missiles that I that I did it over there or you can build your own it's up to you but I'll get to that uh, at the end of the tutorial so what you want to do next is make sure you just put all your buttons along your doors if you got them opened or closed like this and my map it my world is starting to glitch out a bit with the chunks not loading in all right so what you want to do next is you're just going to grab your whatever black block uh, white block you use and you're just going to pretty much go two four six eight and it's be on the eighth you're just going to cut that out so there should be seven white blocks black blocks there just put in your white blocks there with your button on top and that pretty much finishes off this uh well, I would say first layer, but it's not really a first layer. Well, it's pretty much this first layer on top. So let's get on to the tower, and we'll get onto that now. Make sure you copy that to the other side, by the way, before we go any further, before I forget. And yeah, let's get onto it. Okay, so for the cunning tower, we're just going to build this up to a height of seven including the blocks we've already placed down. So the, including those, it should be two, four, six, then seven. Pretty much wrap that around and just all the way around to the other side as well. So pretty much just build the whole thing up by seven. Like so. And then once you've built it all up, I'll, I'll get to that in a second. Once you've built this whole thing up, you're just pretty much going to fill it in on the top level. Like that. Then we'll get to this little uh, fins on the side, which should be what? Uh, should be on the fourth. Yep, it's on the fourth block on this row two. You've got to put a two. Let me just have a look. Then you're going to put another two, and then you're going to have a one, and you're going to pretty much turn that one into a three, and then drag it inwards so it should be two two then a three going back four going in like that okay uh not a three not a four a uh no three a two so it should be two two and then two going in and then a four like that copy that to the other side we're going to grab the next blocks we need which are all cobblestone walls and fence gates and a slab Right, so to start us off, we're just going to skip two, and then we're going to cut out a plus symbol, and then we're going to put in a box, then a, I mean a, a plus symbol, then put a button on top. You're going to come behind that, you're going to build this up by three on the fences, like so. Then you're going to skip a block, you're going to put two cobblestone, then two fence gates, uh, come behind that, I don't know if that's, yeah, okay. So for the uh, right side, you're just going to come back one, you're going to come out, and you're just going to build this up by four. Like that. So it should, there should be a, a, block in a block gap between them. Okay, then you're going to skip two blocks from this cobblestone wall, you're going to build this up by three. One, two, three, uh, three actually four. And then you're going to put in uh, three end rods or fence gates, whatever you choose to use, it's up to you. Then what you're going to do next is you're going to come to the back, you're going to skip a block, and then you're going to put one, two, three. I mean, uh, no, it's two, I think. Yeah, no, it's two. Two cobblestone walls and then a slab, like so. And that finishes off the conning tower. Now, when you Pick your numbers for it with uh, with your banners. So whatever banners you use, I'll just use black to show where they are. 
you want it, it's usually three numbers for these, they go about there. So whatever number you choose to use, uh, just search it up uh, or hire a class submarine on Google, go on Wikipedia, and this is if you've got it out of the water, banners don't work on the water, uh, go on Wikipedia and just scroll down and it'll have a list of the subs and the numbers for them. And it's pretty much that's it. So remember that's on Wikipedia and that finishes off section two. So section two is pretty, base, pretty basic because it just continues the pattern. We'll get on to section three, which is the uh, back section. Alright, so let's get on to that. Okay, so now for section three, so what we want to do is start us off, we're going to go seven, um, right behind here, we're going to go two, four, six, seven, then we're going to pretty much fill in the middle, so we bring it in line with that seven, then we're going to go three, so one, two, three, and then I'll be a three by three, and then a two, and that will finish off this layer. So let's get on to the next layer. Okay, so to start this next bit off, we're just going to go 3, and then we're going to go 8, so 2, 4, 6, 8. Then we're going to come back here, we're going to fill that in, and then we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4. Come back in, fill them behind there, and then we're going to go 3, 1, 2, 3. We're going to fill that in, so it should be 2, 4, 6, and then we're going to add another 3 to make it 9. Then we're going to grab our glass block and our white. So what we should have is we should have 18 glass blocks. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. And then we're going to have 3. 1, 2, 3. Like that. Cut out those glass blocks and copy that to the other side and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so to continue this off, we're gonna put down three, so one, two, three. Then we're gonna come back, we're gonna come in a block, we're gonna go two, four, six, eight, ten. So it's probably it's gonna be ten down this one. Then we're gonna cut fill in these two. We're gonna go three, one, two, three, fill in that one, and then we're gonna go one, two, three. Three. And then we're going to fill that in. We're going to one, two, three, four, five. Fill that in. We'll go one, two, uh, three, four, five. Is that five? I'm pretty sure that was five. Two, four. Two, two four, five. Okay, yep, that was five. And then we're going to come back to the end here. We're just going to put in four. One, two, three, four. So it should be a block going inwards. And that finishes off this layer. And let's get on to the next layer. Okay, so let's get on to this next layer. So what we're gonna do to start us off, we're just gonna pretty much build that in line with that. And we're gonna go two, four, uh, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it should be eight plus three. So it should be 11. Then we're gonna go five. So two, four, five. This comes in a block. And then we're gonna go two, four, five. I'm going to come in a block, and we're going to go 2, 4, 6, seven, two, four, six 7. Then we're going to put two blocks behind there. We're going to go 2, 4. Go in a block here, we're going to put one there, and then we're going to put 6, so it should be 2, 4, 6. So 6 plus the one on the inside, so that would make that that'd be 7. And then on top of this white block, we should have just another row of 4. And there should be a two block gap between that. And if there isn't, uh, rewatch that layer or just count your blocks. So it should be six and then the one on the inside, then two, four, two, four, five, uh, two, four, six, plus the one on the inside, then two, four, plus one on the inside, two, four, five, and then two, and then 11. That one was. Okay, so let's get on to the next layer. Uh, make sure you, before we get on to the next layer, make sure you copy that to the other side. Make it easier in the long run rather than doing one side up at once and then uh, building the other side up next to it. It's easier to do it in one run. So make sure you copy that to the other side and we'll get on to the next layer. 
Okay, so for the next layer, what we're going to do is we're going to place down five, so two, four, five, and then we're going to put two behind that, and we're going to go two, four, six, eight, ten. Yep, that's ten. And then we're going to go four, so one, two, three, four. Then we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then we're going to go two, four, six with that one uh, behind it, make sure you go one and then six. Hang on, two, four, six. Yeah, okay, so that should be a total of seven. Then where we got this, uh, we're gonna go two, four. Is that on the fourth, like on the fourth one, we're gonna go in, we're gonna go two, four, six, eight, nine, two, four, six, eight, nine. Yep, nine, and I'm just gonna get rid of that. Then we're gonna go one there, and I'm just gonna pretty much drag this one back. But this back one should be a block, I'm pretty sure. Yes, it's a block. It's a white block. Well, it's a black block, but we're using white for this. All right, so once you've done that, copy that to the other side. There's your view from the top. You can't really count that out, but that's what it should look like. And let's get on to the final red layer. Okay, so for the next layer, what we're going to do is we're going to start off with a 9. So 2, 4, 6. A nine. Then we're going to do another nine. So two, four, six, eight, nine. Got to cover it again. We're going to do six, two, four, six. Going to come in again. Do another six, two, four, six. Then a seven, two, four, six, seven. So it should be nine, nine, six, six, seven, and then another six, two, four. Oh, five. Never mind. That's a five. Uh, five and then a one on the end. Like that. There's the top view. And that is the last of the red block that we need. Because then the rest is uh, black. And plus the propeller on the end. But we'll get, I'll get to that at the end. Alright, let's get on to the next layer. Okay, so let's start off with the black layer. And what we're going to do is we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11, 12. So it should be 12. And then we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, uh, 9. So it should be 9. 2, 4, 6, 8, 9. Yep. And then we're going to go back in, in a block and we're going to go 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Go in a block. Go 2. Four, six, two, four, six, seven. Go in a block. Go one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, go six. Then we're gonna put three in behind that. So it should be on the second one. We're gonna go three back. We've got to put in our uh, sandstone block there. And then from this point here, we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five. Bring this forward by four. Uh, fill that in. So just fill all of that in. We're going to come in to this corner. We're going to go one, two, three. Should be three. Yep. Uh, do that real quick. And then underneath, we're just going to go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then go one, two, three on the end. Like that. And then pretty much on top, we're just going to pretty much do the same. Uh, two fours and then a three. Do that to the other side as well. Like so. So your back end should look like that so far. If, when, once you've copied that to the other side. So make sure you do copy that to the other side. I'm just going to quickly get rid of these blocks. So it should look like that. Okay, let's get on to the next layer. Okay, so to start this next layer off, we're just going to go 9. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 9. We're going to put three, uh, 6 behind this, so 2, 4, 6. So there should be a gap of 3 behind this 3 here. Then we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 9. So it should be, in, should be 9 to uh, 9 blocks here. We're going to go in by a block. We're going to go 2, 4, 
six. I'm going to go in by block again. It's going to be two, four, six again. Put two blocks on the inside. Go two, four, six, seven. Come in by block and go two, four, five. Then put three on the end. Three up on top of this sandstone block. And we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so let's continue this on. So what we want to do is to continue this, we're going to go two, four, then five. And then we're going to put two on top of that. And then we're going to go ten, two, four, six, eight, ten. And we're going to come back in. We're going to go four. One, two, three, four. Come back in again. We're going to go two, four, six, seven. Seven. And then we're going to come back in again. Go two, four, six six, seven, and I come back in and fill in four, and then we're going to add two, four, five on the end, come back in, fill, fill a block in, uh, actually it's fill two blocks in, and then we're just going to pretty much drag this all the way to the end, actually a block short of the end, so it should be what, two, four, five, six, seven, and that finishes off this layer. Copy that to the other side, and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so let's get on to the next layer. And before we do, I just forgot to quickly change some. All right, so for the next layer, we're going to put 11, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. Then we're going to come in by block. We're going to go 2, 4, 5. Put a block behind that, and then go 2, 4, and then put a block behind that 4. We're going to come back in again. We're going to go two, four, six. Put two blocks on the end, and then go two, four. Then what we're going to do is we're going to come back here, and we're going to go eight. So it'll be two, four, six, eight. So it should pretty much put fill in those two blocks there. And that finishes off this layer. We've got three layers left, and then we've got the propellers to do, and then we're finished. So let's get on to that. So let's continue this off. So what you want to do now is you just want to put in four. So two, I meant three, uh, put in three, put uh, three. <laughs> then come in by a block and then we're going to go two, four, six, eight, ten. So this should be ten blocks along here. Going to put in two behind that. Then we're going to go three, one, two, three. Put a block behind that. Go one, two, three. Put a block behind that. Go one, two, three, four, five. And then we're going to come to the end here. We're going to put a block on top of that one again. We're going to go 9. So 2, 4, 6, 8, 9. Like so. And did I get that wrong? No, I think it's 10. 4, 6, 8, 10. I do have a feeling it's 9, but we'll just go in 10. doesn't matter if we put in an extra block. I'd rather be t uh, one over than one short. So, all right. So... Uh, I'm going to quickly do this back tower up because we ha I haven't been doing that. So skip two blocks here. Go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. How high is that two? And then one, two, three. And then that finishes off that very back bit there. And we'll get on. Make sure you copy that to the other side and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so it was actually nine on this last on this last layer. So we'll cut that one out. And we're going to come back to the front. We're going to go two, four, six, two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. So it should be eleven. And actually, that's not right. So sorry about that. Uh, cut that out. Go two, four, five. Then we're going to come in by a block. Go two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Then we're going to come back in here. We're going to go two, four behind there. Put in a two, four, and we're going to come back to about to this uh, roll last roll two. We're going to go two, uh, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it should be eight behind there. Should be th uh, all right. So it should be uh, what two, four, five, six, four, three, five, six, four, three. And then we're going to go one, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Pretty much fill that in. 
and wait a minute, I'm just gonna stop it, we'll just do it now. Alright, so we're gonna go to here, we're gonna go two, four, five, one, two, uh, two, and then we're gonna go behind there, go one, two, three, four, one, two, on the end there. And then pretty much build that up on the other side, so it goes two, four, two, and then two, four, five. And that'll finish off this whole back section. And that finishes off the main body. All we just gotta do is do the propeller now, and I'll just quickly get that moved over closer here so I can put it on. Okay, so these are a little bit complicated, but all possible. So what you want to do to start off, you're going to build this out by three. And then behind it, I'm just going to have, maybe have another look real quick. We're going to put a staircase there, a staircase there, and one down there like that. And see, yep, that's correct. Okay, so what we're going to do next, I'm just, just bear with me a second. We're going to grab our staircases. We're going to put one there, put it one on top of that, and then one behind that, like that. Oops. So it should be a staircase, staircase, staircase. And then for this one, this is a little bit complicated. We're just gonna uh, put a block there, then a staircase on top of it, then a slab underneath it, like so, and of course it would start raining. Okay, so for this next one, we're going to pretty much do the same as we did on top. We're just going to put an upside down one there, and a right side up one there, then one like that. So it should look like that. And what next? Okay. So for the next one, we're going to, where this staircase is down here, we're just going to put one out there, an upside down staircase there, and a slab there, like that. Then for the last one, um, just going to quickly have another look. We're going to put a slab there, a block there, and a staircase there, like that. And that should finish it off there. Here's another look at it, if you're filming it this way. But that should finish off this whole build. Now, as I did say at the start, uh, I don't know who designed this sort of propeller. It was on a server that I built on, but I don't know who designed it. But once you've built that, if you've built it with the right colors, it, if you build it in white, you built it in white. That's your choice. If you built it in black, this is what it should look like finished, and we'll quickly grab the ballistic missile that I designed here, uh, open it up, grab that cobblestone wall out, uh, staircase, and slab. So if you're building it inside the silo, what you're going to do is uh, you're going to cut out those uh, trap doors out that were down the bottom, you're going to put it in a staircase there, staircase there, staircase there, and there. Put a cobblestone wall, and then pretty much build a plus symbol. And you're going to build that up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight times. I'm pretty sure I, I have. I hope I count that right. Actually, I don't know if we're going to build it seven times. Hey, I'm going to count that again real quick because I have a feeling I stuffed that up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, now seven times. Put one on top there. Uh, staircases wrapped around it. And then a slab on top. Like that. And that's what your ballistic missile should look like inside. And here's what it looks like outside. It's pretty basic, but it's the best you can do for it with the limitations we got. So two, four, six, seven. Yep. If you build it in black, you build the 
uh, I saw a photo of this one. You build four up on the bottom in black, a white line, then a black line, and then a white line again. And a little black bit on top. Uh, just use your um, dark oak slabs and stuff, for stuff like that. But besides from that, that pretty much finishes up this tutorial. So if you use this on a server, please do give credit. Um, that's all I ask. Uh, feel free to, if you're new around here, feel free to subscribe. Uh, leave a comment. I do read your comments. I don't respond to all of them, but I do read. I do read them. Uh, hit that like button. If you want to, you can support me on Patreon. Join the Discord. All that stuff will be linked in the description below. And I will catch you all later. Peace out.